Welcome to Get Lockered. I'm Nancy. I enjoy buying abandoned storage lockers when I can find them at a reasonable rate. I also like to shop at the Goodwill and the resale stores like Salvation Army and the DAV and other thrift stores. And my buyer, Jesse, and I both love to shop at yard sales and estate sales. All in hopes of finding treasures that we can bring into Get Lockered Resale at 217A West 7th Street in Augusta, Kansas. And we can sell the items to you at one third or below what I can find them listed on eBay sold. I sell my items at a low cost so that you can buy and resell your items at a higher price and we can both profit. Thank you for being here. Like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate your support so much. Get Lockered. Hi. I have been going through the doing a fine sort of some of the jewelry and items that we found in the storage locker this last week. And I've already shown you this gorgeous, gorgeous Rolex watch that I fully intend to take to the jeweler and have appraised. It is a beautiful gold Rolex watch with the, it's got the three diamonds in it. It's not one to focus. There we go. And then over here is a necklace and bracelet set. And then this is, these are kind of like threaded beads. I mean, it's like the threads wrapped around the beads. This is just a little black bead necklace. This is a chunky orange bead necklace. Very nice. This one has a little bit of a chain and it goes into chunky blue and silver beads. This is white and then it's got a strand of beads. This is two strands of beads with the, like the coach emblem C's on it. Does it say coach on it? Let's see if we can see what it says. It says focus. I can't really read hospitality or hospice or something. It's got a number. Can't really read it. But anyway, there's that. Then this has a really long chain on it. This is all costume jewelry, I'm presuming. I don't think any of it has it. This one might with that clasp the way it is and these beads being knotted in the middle I'm going to take them and have them checked but they look like real because they're, they're not exactly white see the difference in the color there okay and then this is a beautiful necklace And then this is a strand of, see this might be another old strand of beads. But this might be from the 70s, I'm thinking. Then this necklace here. And then there's a chain here. It goes off this way. We'll come back down on another chain that's got three strands braided with little white pearls on it. Then we'll come down this necklace to there. Then we got these two best friends necklaces 
Then we've got, this is a Chunky Monkey necklace. This one, when I looked it up, it said it was rare, but I don't think it's really rare. Otherwise, I wouldn't have found it. This one, I'll put a clip right in here of this one and show you how it glows with a black light. Look at this. And then over here, excuse my dirty towel. I've been sorting jewelry for a couple hours here. This looks like a, pan, maybe Pandora. I don't know. It's not marked that I can tell. But it looks like there was a baby girl born in October. Is what I'm going to guess from this bracelet. This is a pair of clip-on earrings. These are pierced earrings. They're very pretty. Pull this up. You can see how pretty that is. It's really pretty. This is one of those bracelets that this thing right here snaps, if it'll focus, it snaps down. You can buy these little things that snap in there like a button, and it's a bracelet. And then here's a pretty pair of pierced earrings. And this is some little post stud earrings. It looks like tiger eye. And there's a necklace in the store that we found the other day that matches these earrings. And then this is a brooch right here. I'm going to guess it's very old. I don't see any markings on it. But it just looks old and looks like like the real real McCoy there to me um but it, it just might not be might just be made to look old and here's another pair of earrings this is a, the nativity bracelet i'll throw a little snapshot still shot picture of this in there I'll throw a still shot picture of this really pretty little, let me find it, it's adjustable size ring. It's got, it's not missing any stones, but I'm going to guarantee to you that it's not real silver or anything like that. And then this is a very pretty pair of rings. I couldn't find a mark on them, but they're very nice looking. And these are some post earrings. This is a really pretty brooch here. This is a mid-century, you can see it's a lion, but it's a wax melt stamper. You melt the wax on an envelope and you stamp it with this. Somebody mentioned that they thought it might should have been on a chain. This is just a very pretty bracelet. This is a very pretty brooch. It has age to it. I don't see any markings on it. Well, it looks like a little, What it does have a marking on it. You see, like a focus on it. Castle Elite. Uh, I don't know. If you can make that out, more power to you. This is a Christmas pin. Looks like a wishbone with a bow. On it. This is a cancer ribbon pin. 
This one, I'll put a snapshot in. It's a letter P. Uh, maybe I don't need to put a snapshot in there. It's a letter P. I found it online for maybe, I think it was six to eight dollars. These are real gold, but there's only one of each one of them. And look at this. This is an absolutely beautiful brooch. I can't find any markings on it. You can tell it was well loved and well worn. I think that's just some schmutz on it. That is very beautiful. The closest I could find in value on this was ranged between $43 and $112. So, and then I found some Avon button covers over here. Aren't really much anything. Look at this pair of pliers. They're from Revlon. It's two in one. This is one. This is one. But it's all one set. I've never seen anything like it. Never have. Oh, I forgot this pair of heart earrings right here. And then this bottle had jewelry in it. It was full of jewelry when I got it. And it is a Ben Reichert from Wayne, New Jersey. And I looked it up on eBay and it lists for about $28, $28 to $34. And then I found all of these. They're just single chains. There's no openers, closers, or nothing. They're just long single chains. We found all these. It's a pile of chains. And yep, that's what. Oh, this is an earring. It's a screw back earring, so I know it's old. But I don't. I well so you can't even see it it's a screw back earring so I know it's old but you know the stones they're not missing they're all there they're just so discolored and so I can almost want to say they're not real stones but the way they're discolored and stuff I'm gonna guess that these stones were closer to the person's neck and when they were worn but there was only one of them so yeah it's just a little short video of the items that i found at the goodwill uh not at the goodwill i'm sorry i was so wrong they were in the last storage unit that i got and i believe there's more jewelry in the garage somewhere when i go through that i'll let you see that too Thanks for being here. Now we are at the Goodwill in El Dorado. It's still snowing and sleeting. Let's go in and see if we can find anything that's wrecked for the store. Okay, now we'll look through the purses and bags. See if they've got anything. Red Hat Society. Jeez, I can fill that one up. That take hold a lot of receipts. Done, done, mini done. Amanda, and you hold it like this. Brrr. This is the hard section. Amanda. All you need is love and a dog. Well, I got two dogs, so we're good. <laughs> Put them underneath the truck and head home. It works. This is pretty. It's Lucite. I bet you would like it. Books. Isn't that cute? Yeah. 
That's a cute little cherub statue. The music's really loud in here. I'm sorry. I'm going to have to kind of cover it with my... Cover the microphone with my hand. <laughs> What'd you find? <laughs> she found a dog in a fire hydrant, salt and pepper shakers. That's a cute little teapot. Oh, it's the bottom of a set. <clears throat> A little pyramid. Oh. Oh, well, his wing is broke. <clears throat> or her wing. Oh. I'm hearing crickets. I found the praying hands, guys. I just point. How dare you! Ah, man. Yo, drew up on PlayStation games. Is that the Capitol? And the Lincoln Tower? What? Is it a video camera? I have one of those in the store. Hmm? This is broken off of something. Shadly. I see one of those at the other Goodwill. Hey, what's this for, Amanda? Beach. Radio. It's got a tan timer on it. Oh, you push it with your arms. Uh, you push it with your legs. Well, they show it with the arms. I found baby shark. You find baby shark every time you come here. You do it upset. Oh, I see. Do your belly. Oh, I see. It's just like a resistance thing. <laughs> On that note, ooh, this is pretty. Oh. Look. Okay. Little wire feet. There's a little fox. Goodwill transforms. Oh, we went down that road. Goodwill, we take local donations and transform them into funding for our employment and life skills training. Baskets area. When you donate your gently used clothing and housewares to Goodwill, you are doing a lot of good for your neighbor. And Goodwill donations are tax deductible too. Consider cleaning up the clutter and donating to support Goodwill's mission today. The perfect gift is never returned. It always fits. It's always appreciated. And we've got it right here at Goodwill. It's a Goodwill gift card. Purchase gift cards for any <coughs> from any sales associate. It's a perfect gift for any occasion.
We need this for Butch's office, Amanda. What are you dibsing? How much are they? They're both the same Yeah, price. you can get them. Easter. What? Okay. Oneida Silversmith USA. I don't know if they're silver or silver plated. Oh. I found a hammer. That is a croquet mallet. That's pretty. Got two darts. Here's a gun. That's pretty. Put ketchup in that, put it on my kitchen table. like the shady it's the cool oh cool okay <clears throat> starting Easter a little early um you remember that hot challenge uh what? you did yeah is this it No. Check see if there's anything in these boxes, please, for me. Well, here he is. Okay, put it back in the box. Yeah. Now, let me Look. Check. Now, let me move. I put them in my pocket for now. It's sad that the baby Jesus is missing out of there. Oh, it's a train collection. Okay, okay. Well, no truth. Is there what I mean? Yes, Minnie Mouse is there. Okay. Want them in the cart? Yes, please. Okay. Move those inside. I promise I won't break them. <clears throat> where did, where did Minnie go? She didn't even make There they are. No, that's the same size balls I have now. I still need bigger balls.
some toys if there's anything vintage. I didn't see that. It's an angel and a cross. CJ, where's my cart? Amanda has it. Oh, okay. That's fine, as long as I know where it's at. Hey, I have the same pig in my store. <clears throat> this is the lid to that cup that was in the other Goodwill. The cup to the lid? The, the cup to the lid. Yeah. The lid to the cup. Oh, oh here, I need to put these in the cup. Is this right down? Uh-huh. How much is it? Because I sell them for, oh. I sell them for $4 in my store. If I have to pay 7 I'm losing money. Is it blue? Oh, no, but blue. What is that? I don't know. Does it go up anymore? I mean, because the spring? Is it for exercise? I don't think so. I don't. Wow. <clears throat> I have nothing. I don't either. That is very unusual. Isn't What would you do with it? Just let it sit there? Dust it. Dust it. You're right. <laughs> Dust it. <laughs> yes. It hangs like this so it would be a little H. Don't walk in front of me. I may not follow. Don't walk behind me. I may not lead. Walk beside me and just be my friend. That's pretty. Did she learn to read? I'm learning how to read, yes. Am I doing okay? Why that? would they put that on a alcohol glass? You know, you got a good point. Maybe it turns an alcohol glass into an orange juice glass. For drinking your orange juice in the morning. I'm pretty sure it's a whiskey glass. I'm sure it is. <laughs> oh, I have to have all of those. Amanda, you saw these. Did you see the dog and bone? Pretty. That's pretty. Look at this. Well, that is pretty. I like the paint and the texture on that. I didn't see the bone. <coughs> I think her wings are bone. 
Yeah, her Change the yeah, give him a job. Oh. <coughs> Project Peace. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. You know what that is? No. It's another band game. Oh, is it? Yeah. Pretty cool. Oh, that's cute. I know. Nice. I have so many trinket boxes in the store. Hey, see if this glows. That's an ashtray. That's really old. Mm. A little bit of green, but not much. Just from the light. Yeah. <clears throat> Put it in the sun and let the sun fade it to purple and then it'll glow. Is this party light? What, what about these? What are they? They're fine. Hang on. Goodies? Yeah. These? Uh -uh. These? Uh-huh. You know what? That would be awesome for looking at if it for looking at jewelry. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Cause it's got a light. Oh yeah, let's get those. How much are they? A dollar ninety nine. Let's get those. It'd be great for looking up looking at jewelry to see. Need adjusts. Oh, awesome. Big ones? Is this big enough? That's not big enough. Oh. That's Japanese. Amanda. Oh, wow. Oh, that's pretty. I know you like the I like that one. <clears throat> Okay, I'm not seeing a whole lot here, so I'm going to cut this short. No, I don't. I have one on my steering wheel. I'm going to cut this video, and I'll tell you what I get after the checkout. Guardian Angels of Dog Owners protect shoes, furniture, and coat carpets. There we go. I need one of those. A guardian angel of a dog owner. I mean, a guardian angel for me, because I have dogs. So, okay, I'll tell you what we spend at the checkout. Okay, our total spent there was twenty nine twenty six, and we rounded up to 30 because that's what you do at the Goodwill. Do something nice for somebody. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and get locked.